called the Sultan's Meal. It's a very fine feast of of uh, foods, and it's called the Sultan's Meal. It's called that because the great Sultan of Rum. This was his favorite meal, and he would always have this at least three or four times a week. The great Sultan and and. The Sultan, you know, he liked the finer things in life. He liked the good stuff, you know. He, he didn't deal in inferior goods and products and, and meals and foods. He went for the best. But even he, a Sultan, knew that the best things aren't necessarily the most expensive. And you can have a great meal, a fine feast with just a couple of dollars I mean couple of Turkish dollars and he was a great Sultan and all the people said wow this is such a good he's such a good Sultan we are very respectful to him because of his great greatness and his loyalty to the people which is which who we are who we hum who the people and this sultan g gave recipes and tips. He said, get the best Vegemite you can find without paying too much, he told the people. He said, your pumpkin pie, make sure it's good, pumpkin pie. And your bread, make sure the bread ain't bad. Check for uh, signs. And the people who have been eating this meal for hundreds of years, thousands of years before him, um, finally started putting some thought into their little meal. And the Sultan was revered as one of the best guys around. So he, he had uh, a cohort that he, he was with back in school you know that they they knew about this meal because even back in school before he was he graduated and became the sultan you know all his uh, friends would uh he was from a wealthy family and they and they were all from wealthy families and the the sultan would eat it he would whip it out at lunchtime and the, his friends would be like <laughs> wait stupid why aren't you eating the uh lamb soup or whatever uh, hot shot foods that they had and he's like guys lamb soup's great and it's expensive but this is even better and it's not even that expensive i can put the money towards paying off my student loans with if i you know my parents are rich but i don't like to rely on them i like to be uh you know uh self-reliant self-sufficient even so he d and his friends were like get out of here that's what poor people eat and he's like you ever hear, and then the sultan said, turned to his friends, and he's like, you ever hear those poor people complain? And that's when, that's when it all kicked off. And no one else stepped in and gave him lip. And it even started popping up around the cafeteria. More people were bringing in their little Vegemite canisters and their uh, apple pie cartridges. And they were printing out flyers, you know, with recipe ideas and uh, wine pairings, and it all it all culminated to the Sultan's meal. That's what that's, that's where the term comes from. So I'm gonna go eat this. Put a little put a little thought into your food. How about that?